My Hero 1's Justice 2 is just a couple months away, and you might be wondering why I haven't made a video talking about it in a while, and that's really because nothing that big has come out in the news recently about it. Most of the characters revealed were already confirmed at the time the game was announced, and there haven't really been any new surprises, although 100% full counting Deku is pretty awesome. But don't get me wrong, I am excited for the game and look forward to playing, however I can't help but notice one thing missing from any type of marketing for this game, and that is the story mode. You can literally look up My Hero Wants Justice 2 story mode on any search engine and you'll pretty much find little to no information on it. Now the story mode for the first one's Justice game was very poorly received. It suffered similarly to Jump Force, although Jump Force got a worse reputation because of it, mainly to do with the fact that One's Justice was made for one anime community and Jump Force was made for fans of many different series. But what the game suffered from is the fact that the story mode didn't really feel that focused on, especially when most of the cutscenes looked like this. <laughs> お前を止めに来た。人間に産む。兄弟か。四つを天分のため生かした。お前は弱いな。お前もお前の兄も弱い。偽物だからだ。誰が来た？兄様多くの人を助け。I respect the developers of One's Justice, but I have to admit those cutscenes are what we expect from a mobile game, not one made for console, and published by a company as relevant as Bandai Namco. Now they did have some decent cutscenes like this.今の僕が掛け合わせられる最高最適の個性たちで君を殴る。緑や伊豆区。上と先は彼だろう。近くもなしに来てしまって、まるで制御できてないじゃないか。存分に食いてしぬといいよ。オールマイト。先生としても。But honestly, that wasn't enough to save the game's story mode. Once Justice 2 needs to have a story mode completely different than the original. I'm not talking about the story because we all know it's going to tell the story of the anime up to season 4, but it's how they should tell the story in the game. In simple terms, it just needs to bring a story mode that's way more enjoyable. But the fact that they've hidden the story mode off from the public tells me either they've waited to reveal something really good about it, or it's basically going to be exactly the same as the first game, and that honestly kind of scares me. But I would like to get your thoughts on this, so let me know what you guys think. I want to thank you guys for watching, my name's Konjic, and I'll talk to you in the next video.